In today's video, we're gonna learn how to set up WordPress hosting. First things first, we need a host. And for this video, we're gonna go with SiteGround. It's an optimized WordPress hosting provider, meaning that the server and its settings are specifically tailored for WordPress. And every SiteGround plan has a bunch of features, including free SSL, site migration, business email, any content delivery network. Prices are affordable too, starting at just $2.99 per month. Make sure to use our link in the blog post or in the video description to help support our channel and all of our ad-free videos. Just go ahead and click get plan. And what's really nice is you actually get a free domain name with the plan. So just go ahead and enter it here and you'll get it free for the first year. If you don't want to get your domain through your hosting provider, we recommend using Namecheap, which we'll leave a link to down below. Now let's just hit continue. We're going to go ahead and fill out all of this information and hit pay now. Once that's done, you should be logged in and see a similar page to this. And now all we have to do is click manage under websites. As you can see, we have quite a few going on here. And now I'm just going to press new website at the top right. At this point, you'll be able to continue with the free domain that was provided by SiteGround. However, if you have a domain purchased elsewhere, like Namecheap, you would select existing domain and go ahead and connect it. For the sake of this tutorial, I'll use a temporary domain, which is the same process once you get your domain connected. And we'll just hit continue. For this step, it's crucial that we select start new website. We're not migrating a website and we also do not want to create a blank site. So let's hit select. The reason we did this is because SiteGround offers one click installs. So you won't have to figure out how to install WordPress yourself. So we'll just go ahead and click select for WordPress. Now let's enter an email address and a password for our website. It's going to ask if you want to add a site scanner and site scanner premium. We're just going to go ahead and click no thank you. They're also going to offer other extras, but let's go ahead and select finish. And now SiteGround is going to go ahead and spin up our website and we don't have to lift a finger. And there we go. As you can see, it says you are all set. We have three different options here. And and the one that we're going to go with is login admin. This will bring us to our WordPress dashboard. And just like that, we are now logged in to our WordPress website. The next step is to purchase, download, and install Divi. This is the first of many steps in your WordPress journey. If you want to learn how to build a WordPress website from beginning to end, check out this video on the screen now. With that said, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.